Today I want to talk to you about why we should not worry. In Matthew 6, 25 to 31, Jesus preached against worry. Three times he said, do not worry. In verse 26, Jesus said, Look at the birds. They do not sow, nor reap, nor gather into storehouses. Yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not far more valuable to God than they are? Worry is probably one of the major reasons for stress. Worry will hold one captive, waste one's time, sap one's energy, and rob one of today's joy. Listen, worry is fear-based. Worry is meditating on things that we are afraid of. The Bible Bible says God has not given us the spirit of fear but of power love and of sound mind Satan is the author of fear and fear will give the devil legal entry into one's life fear is a spirit that must be resisted and here are three nuggets to help you resist fear number one first John 4 18 God's love sets us free from fear and worry when we understand how much God loves us fear will leave us when we are afraid we are not persuaded about how much God loves us. When we allow his love to fill our hearts, fear and worry will go out the back door. Number two, fear and worry can only flourish in the absence of faith. So instead of trying to fight fear, get full of faith and fear will be displaced. Faith is the expectation of good. Fear is the expectation of evil. People who are in faith are excited about tomorrow and people who are in fear dread tomorrow. Tip number three, avoid meditating on wrong things. Worry is wrong meditation. Worry is meditating on things that contradict the word. The Bible says in Philippians 4 8, whatever is true, pure, honorable, whatever is lovely, excellent, praiseworthy, think and meditate on these things, and the God of peace will be with you.